A new tonight incident caught on camera between two students on the campus of Sacramento State has gone viral. Now the university is investigating. ABC 10's Jacques Maluka spoke with both of the students involved and has their reactions to what happened tonight. You leave my friends alone, all right? I'll leave my friends alone. You'll leave them alone? Dude, do you want to talk to Tom Carroll about this? I'm happy to go. There's back nothing to wrong with this. Come There's on. nothing wrong with this. Come on. What have I done? You're harassing me. Huh? This exchange between two Sacramento State political science students has gone viral, being viewed nearly half a million times on Twitter since it was posted Friday. Those involved say the confrontation stemmed over a political debate on Facebook that turned personal and crude. A student's accused of commenting that he wished a child battling cancer to die. And I was kind of like, hey, this is kind of out of bounds. You know, you may have your political um, you know, disputes with someone. But the minute you bring in children, especially ill children, into this, it's kind of off limits and kind of, you know, kind of detestable thing to do. Lloyd Johnson confronted his classmate about the alleged post and recorded this confrontation. I believe I've seen the comment you're referring to. Okay, and that wasn't you? No. Keaton Hall disputes claims he made the post, saying he's been a recent victim of fake profiles, although he is apologizing for his actions depicted in this video. Oh, I don't think I should have let my anger get the best of me. I do acknowledge that was uh, that was wrong, but I, I would like to strongly emphasize that it was not without previous provocation. Although Hall argues he's been the victim of harassment by others shown in this video, claims Johnson denies. Now university officials are investigating. In a letter addressed to the campus community, Sacramento State President Richard Nelson wrote, quote, no one should ever be physically attacked. Everyone deserves to feel safe and secure in expressing their identity and beliefs. I really hope the school takes firm action on this because this is not only something that can, you know, set the bar for this is not allowed on our campus, but also punish this kid um, for also engaging what he engaged in. What have I done? You're harassing me. Whoa, that is not okay. That is not okay.